Hello, my name is Jason Hennick. I'm the program director at Sovereign's program here in Rancho San Diego, and I'm gonna walk you around and give you a virtual tour and show you what it is that we do here. This is our main lobby. This is where everyone enters. Um, here we have Nora David. She is the associate program director. Um, she worked closely with operations and clinical to make sure all the pieces come together. We have Dr. Wassell. She's the site training director. Um, she's in charge of the pre-doc and the post-doc uh, programs here, along with overseeing all the BBS turns, interns and the whole clinical piece. Then we have Dr. Prajinan, another clinical supervisor here, um, works closely with uh, Dr. Wassell. We have Malachi. Malachi is our director of education. Um, in the public world, it'd be known as the principal of the school. She oversees all the parts and pieces of each individual's um, schooling when they come in here. And then here we have the lead house managers, um, which are the supervisors of the shifts 24 hours a day. We have this entire property, which it's all enclosed within 26 acres. We have three different tracks. We have the mental health, the dual diagnosis, and the eating disorder. And they are housed in light groups. To this side, we have two houses, which are boys. Um, the boys' houses are divided into two different tracks, mental health and dual diagnosis. Then we have a third house, which is a girls' house, which is eating disorder. Then on this side, we have two houses, which are girls, which are also divided into two different tracks, mental health and dual diagnosis. This is our cafeteria. This is where the adolescents come three times a day to eat all their meals. We have a kitchen staff here who works with the kids and they do have the ability to give feedback on the foods that they like and prefer. So our kitchen staff finds that balance of making things that are healthy and nutritious and also appeals to the taste of adolescence, which we know is difficult to do at times. This is our intake room and this is the initial step in the process. Upon coming into the facility, the parents come in here and this is where all the information is gathered and put together so that we can best determine how to best meet the needs of the child. On site here is our basketball court. Um, a lot of the adolescents spend a lot of time out here playing on the court. Very popular place to be. This is our swimming pool here that we have on site. Anytime that anyone is in the pool, we do have a certified lifeguard out here watching over them. And needless to say, they love to be out here. Now I'll take you into our recreation room uh, slash gym room. This is where we do yoga, um, rock to recovery, um, doing various groups. Kids love to come in here and work out on some of the equipment that we have. This is where our art therapist comes in um, a couple times a week and gathers the kids together and they work in a lot of mediums whether that's paint, drawing, ceramic, clay. They all get to produce their art and leave it here to share with others. We found this to be a very popular addition to our program. So this is the back of the property. Here we have our school room. We have multi-purpose group rooms, and we also have our clinical offices back here. So let's take you in and uh, say hello to a couple of the clinicians that are here today. This is our clinical offices. Um, our clinical team is made up of postdocs, pre-docs, and uh, BBS registered interns and or licensed clinicians, all overseen by three licensed psychologists here. But come on back, we'll see who's here today. We've got Dr. Cones here, and we've got Brandon. And our clinical team is uh, large, made up of a variety of clinicians, and it's a very diverse group, which is very nice because we are able to make a match between each child that comes through the door, and a decision is made as who would be the best clinician for that individual child. And we have enough of them, we have a broad enough pool that we're able to always find a good fit. So this is our neurofeedback lounge. Within this area, we have neurofeedback, which we use a popular program called Brain Paint. They get feedback on their brain waves, and then they learn how to modulate them. Then we have our biosound lounge here, which they're able to sit down and watch guided imagery. Then we have the massage chair here. All three of these are very popular, and uh, adolescents really enjoy coming back here. So although that we do have everything enclosed within this one property, we do go off-site. We go hiking, we go to the bay, and we also go to equine therapy, which is a local ranch that we go off-site to. We work with adolescents 12 to 17 years old, uh, specifically with those living with mental health and or uh, addiction issues. If you have any questions, feel free to call us here directly. I'll be glad to answer your questions myself 
or connect you with someone who can answer any questions that you may have. So thank you for spending a few minutes and taking a tour with us today.